Be sure to check out FIFACoinsOnline.com for the best deals on FIFA coins for a place you know you can trust. What's up guys, Curtis here and welcome to another little pack opening video. I did one yesterday around this time and I'm going to do one again today. And we have got a pretty cool one. Now as you can see there, we started off with a fantastic 87 rated player. Uh, very, very nice. Sells for quite a bit as well. Uh, brilliant player as well, Andrea Pirlo, one of the better players. Uh, that have played football and that are playing right now in real life and also pretty good in the game too. Lacks a little bit of pace but is still very, very good nonetheless. But anyway, on to what this video is and that is, uh, it's a back opening over the happy hour that EA did a couple days, well, yesterday even, uh, by the time you guys are watching this video. So, basically, what was part of the happy hour? So, they had four special packs. Uh, and every time, so they'd release one special set of packs, which I actually opened one of on the web app and didn't record, but I didn't get anything good in them, and I can't remember what one that was, uh, and that, um, and then as soon as that ran out, there was like 20,000 available for everyone, as soon as they were opened, uh, they then moved on to the next type, which was the all-player... I believe it was the 12.5k packs that you're seeing here, one rare, 12 player packs. And then it went on to, as you'll see in a second, when these ran out, it then went on to the uh, 35k packs, that's right. 30 items in it, 18 of them rare. So that means you could be getting some really good players. There was loads of informs pulled and stuff over the... Uh, over the little period, so that would hopefully, uh, hopefully bring down the cost of bail uh, in form and Robin in form because it's always great when they do these nice uh, happy hours because it gives people even more incentives to buy players and it will lower the cost of any informs even if it's just by like. 10k or something it will have an effect as hopefully more will be bought into the market than would have been done uh, otherwise but my my rare pack wasn't too great we got the uh, the shiny squad fitness and that was about it everything else and it was very very terrible I don't think I kept anything other than the uh, first couple players and that squad fitness so that was a massive disappointment and then the uh, Fourth and final pack type, I believe, will come up in a second. I can't remember what it was. I think it was 25k. Yeah, 25k packs. Uh, players only. 12 players with free rare. So, basically not really worth it. The 12.5k... Gays? Uh, the 12.5 coins. I don't know where that came from. 12.5 coin packs were probably better off for uh, value for money. Even though you got one less rare, you still would have got 12 extra cards. So... Um, swings and roundabouts and all that so uh, that is basically it I did open two of these though as you will see on the screen we've got Judjak in the first one and uh, you'll see who I get in the second one so EA are always a little bit of a letdown I definitely lost money with my packs I know quite a few people did make some money getting quite a few informs and some other great players but uh, I lost money I got PLO, Begovic and AU that's probably my uh, the three highlights of the entire pack opening so when you're saying those when you've spent Oh, easily over 120k I'm not sure exactly how much then you know it's been a bit of a disappointing pack opening but nonetheless that is the end of this pack opening guys if you could leave a like that'd be absolutely fantastic thank you as always for watching subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you guys next time bye